Hello everyone, Average Thomas Fan here, bringing you another video. Today's video, I have a very special package. Um, this is the Hornby Percy and the Mail Train set. Now, I got this for £59, uh, that's roughly $75, on a website called Rails of Sheffield. Um, uh, well, the thing is, it was, it was £59, but I had to pay... Um, a good 37 pounds for shipping, roughly 45 dollars. Um, which I wasn't really happy with, but that was still less than the retail value than it really originally was. But, um, anyway, here's the back. Uh, look at all this stuff you can't buy anymore. <laughs> um, but, uh, part of the reason why I got this was, but well, I do need a Percy model because my Bachman model broke. Um, and also the Hornby range is going, well, it probably already got discontinued. I'm not sure about that. But, uh, basically, you get Percy, you get a mail van, get another van, get a horn controller. I'm not a big fan of these controllers, um, but yeah, I'm, I've, the reason why, another reason why I got this, because, uh, I've been, uh, I really like the Hormy range. Uh, this is like my fifth or sixth Hormy item now. I have the Flying Scotsman train set. I have James's composite and brake coaches. I have the good shed and I have a level crossing as well so yeah it's pretty cool so um, I'm gonna get this out of the box and show you what it comes with all right so first of all we get a DVD which I can't watch because region locking now, this is probably all CGI episodes so oh wait no this is all right um so there's a good amount of Sharon Miller episodes but, okay, so so there's some model series episodes, five of them, and then we have some Brenner era episodes. So overall, this is actually a pretty good selection of episodes, so I'm not gonna lie. Um, but, yeah. Um, I wish I could watch it, though. But, oh well. You got your owner's manual and stuff. And then we have your basic track oval loop and the uh, track pack A, I believe. Um, right here is the Hornby controller. Uh, I'm not a big fan of these controllers. They just feel really cheap. Um, I think right here is, I think it's a buffer. Yeah, it feels like a buffer. Uh, transformers right here. And then, okay. And then here are the mail bins. Yeah, so. And then here are the mail bags and the clips and stuff. And then here we have Percy. Let's get him out of here. There you go. Out you go, Percy. Wow. Is he a beautiful model? Great. I'm not sure whether I like this one or the Bachman Percy better. Because I don't. Uh, because my. Bachman Percy broke, um, and sent it off to Bachman, and I didn't get it back. That was like four years ago. I might make a separate video about that, because that's, that's a completely separate story in itself. But honestly, this is a very nice model. Percy, like, in videos, um, he seems to be, like, a lot paler in green, and in my video right now, he seems to be pretty pale in green, but, um, while I'm looking at him, he looks like the same color as, uh, um, his Bachman model and stuff, so it looks pretty good. Really nice, actually. Wow. Um, I'm gonna probably paint the lamp at the back and the rest of the foot plate, but he's a pretty nice model. Not gonna lie. Alright. And then here is the mail coach. Um, so. I will say that the Bachman mail coaches are better, but I will say I will give this one points because it says Soder Mail on it, and not the it doesn't have the CGI symbols on it. And I believe uh, there are these doors that open up. So like if I yeah, so it like picks it up like that, and then it drops it off from the other door. That's pretty cool. And then we have a little wagon as well. 
um, which doesn't really make sense why it's in the set, but you know what? I will take it. Um, I can always do for some more rolling stock. Um, so I'll get this connected up to my current layout and I'll see you guys then. Make sure that you have the right power adapter. Luckily I have one for my Fly Flying Scotsman set, so it should work, but just know if you don't have one already, you're gonna need a transformer to connect to an American outlet, or if you if you live in the UK, I guess that's not a problem. All right, so I have Percy all hooked up with this train. And I've set everything up, so I'm gonna get one of these little red mail bags and put it in a little post. What's gonna happen is he's gonna run over this ramp, the mailbag's gonna pick it up, and we're gonna go all the way around and he's gonna drop it off right here in this little box. So, all right, here we go. Start a bit slow. There we go, he picked it up. Let's come back around. Here he is, here he comes. Let's see him drop it off. And did he drop it off? There we go, he dropped it off. All right. So, we're all proud for this set. It's a very good set. I highly recommend picking it up. Um, I did pay $108 for it, but considering the range is getting discontinued, um, I would highly recommend it. Plus, I really like this model of Percy. If you don't have, um, if you're on HO slash OO model ra railroader, um, and you like the Tom Bachman Thomas range, um, this Percy is not that bad. I actually think I prefer it to the Bachman one, which I'd, I'd have to do a comparison to get my final say, but um, the rolling stock is pretty nice too, and um, yeah, that's about all I can say on the Bachman Percy, or I'm sorry, the Hornby Percy in the mail train set. Um, anyway, I want to thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.